Remember this, it's a blast from the past, but could this be the key to slamming on the brakes when it comes to distracted driving? A recent op-ed piece in the New York Times wants America to return to the stick shift. Now, the author's argument here, all the bells and whistles on new cars these days are making many drivers far less attentive. So what do you think? Here's 7 Eyewitness News reporter Ala Araby. Are safety and technology features in new cars making us more complacent as drivers? One psychiatrist thinks so. Dr. Vatzel Thacker from NYU says we need to look more closely at how technology is impacting driving skills. Some of the technology seems to be um, added to cars just for the sake of technology and not with a lot of thought process into how it's going to change the behavior of driving and the skills required to drive. Dr. Thacker even says we should go back to driving stick shifts so that all focus would be on the road. Driving a stick shift vehicle is, is one of the purest forms of uh, the marriage of man and machine. According to AAA's annual automated vehicle survey, drivers who have advanced driver assistance systems in their cars are 68% more likely to trust the feature than drivers who don't have them. But the manager of AAA's driving department in Amherst says while these features help you spot trouble earlier, like lane departure assistance or blind spot detection, it's still up to the driver to take the necessary corrective action. All of a sudden, the um, a lane departure warning goes off. You've still got to be able to guide that car back into your lane. He says motorists need to have a better understanding of just what each feature does. AAA's survey shows that the automatic emergency braking feature, which is in 93% of new cars has 40 names. Andrew Streit with Stevens Driving School says while these features are a huge help to drivers, they should never take the place of basic driving skills. The backup cameras and the lane changing sensors and things like that, it's a lot of complacency where people are feel like they don't have to pay attention as much as they probably should. No, people still need to stay up on their regular driving functionality. In Amherst, Ella Airby, 7 Eyewitness News.